haven't had a chance to play him, you know, at the collegiate level. But uh, you know, I think some of the schemes they run for him are, you know, kind of collegiate like. You know, I think it's because that's what he's used to. Um, you know, it has a lot of run pass options and, you know, different things to, you know, try to screw with your eyes so they can, you know, crease you and have those big gas plays and, you know, he has targets who are gonna go up and get the ball. You know, he has guys who are gonna take the top off. So um, you know, this week is gonna be huge in discipline and, you know, making sure your eyes are where they need to be. How do you contain a guy that can beat you with his feet mm -hmm. as well as with his arm and, and not just beat but with those big plays that you alluded to? Um, you know, you just gotta like I say, stay disciplined. D discipline's gonna be the name of this game. Um you know, keeping the quarterback in the pocket, you know, making him beat us with his arm, um, you know, because we know how elusive he can be. Um, even when you think you have him, um, he finds a way uh, to get out and, you know, maybe make a long throw on his playmakers or he makes it on his own with his legs. Um, so, like I said, man, discipline is going to be the name of the game and the key this week. How big is it going to be to have both Jamie and Miles back and not be on the defensive side of the ball? That's going to be a huge addition. Um, we've been... We've been without those guys for you know most of the season. Um, just, just, just the, the the presence alone of those guys, you know, is going to help out the rest of us. You know, um, Miles Miles going to open up a lot of one-on-one -on -one situations for the guys on the defensive line, and Jamie is a smart linebacker who's you know big but also can move in space. Um, so you know they have to account for him too. So. Um, you know, we, we get to, you know, open the scheme up a little bit and, you know, see how it goes. What did you think last week when, you know, Miles plays 19 snaps and first, first snap he gets a sack, he ends up with two sacks mm -hmm. and, and just such a small sample size on the field. I mean, just what, what, what goes through your mind when you see something like that? I mean, well, we've seen it all, uh, we've seen it all training camp, all OTA. So, you know, for, for us, that's just Miles being Miles, you know. Um, but for the people who haven't, you know, gotten a chance to see him play, you know, it's going to be something special for him. Yeah. You haven't gotten a chance to see his defense pull. Yeah. Are you excited to, to kind of get a look, even if it's just in small stretches? Um, you know, anytime you're healthy, man, that's always a plus. Um, you know, we're definitely, we're definitely help. Uh, it definitely helps having those guys back, and we're definitely ready to see how, you know, we can put it together. So. You know, we're looking forward to this week. We have a big task at hand, and, you know, we never shy away from any challenge. So, you know, we're going to hit it head on. With those guys back, does your, uh, does your role evolve or change or, or whatnot within Greg's system? Uh, those, are all, those are all schemes. The scheme changes week to week, you know, no matter who's playing. Um, you know, it's, 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 it's next, next man up. But, you know, having those guys back will definitely give us some depth and, you know, add to what we can do. So. You know, who knows? You know, it's the beginning of the week. Um, so, you know, we're going to try some things out and see how it goes. It, it looked like you blitzed more last week. Is, is that accurate to say it was more last uh, week? Yep, it's very accurate. <laughs> <laughs> is, that, is that what you mean by it could change every week? Or do you expect more of that as we move forward? Uh, yeah, that's exactly what I mean. You know, um, you know, sometimes, you know, you may maybe a guy who blitzes, now you're playing deep. Or, you know, maybe a guy who played deep, now you're blitzing. Or, you know, things, things along along that line. It's just what they do best, what we do best, and how can we be the best at what we do and take away what they do best. So, you know, that's 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 the name of the game. And, you know, every week presents a new a new challenge, so every week is a new scheme, so. When you watched that film of the rough and call, did, it, did you see anything that made you think, yeah, they got it right? Um, well, when I got to the sideline, you know, they said I kind of like hit his helmet. You know, apparently, you know, you, you know, you can't really touch those guys. Um, so, I mean, I, I didn't personally think I did anything, you know, m malicious. I even tried to like soften the fall for him. Um, but you no, know, that was a that was a huge play in the game. Um, you know, that would have been off the field, and then they would have had to punt be behind their own forty. And so that gives you a chance in the return game. So it's just plays like that, man. You know, you, you can't have them back. Sometimes it rolls the way you want, sometimes it don't. So, but for me looking at it, I didn't think I did anything, you know, malicious. Um, but if you can't hit him on a helmet, it's in the rule book. I kind of, you know, did get him on a helmet. So, you know, I guess he had to throw the flag. Those guys being evaluated just like we are. Did you 
void of fine, or did you get? Um, I don't know yet. So that's 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 gonna be the uh, that's gonna be the next thing. Uh, I'm sure if I do, it'll be on my seat. So I'll let you guys know. Um, yeah, it definitely felt good. Definitely felt good. Yep. Um, just to mix it up now. Um, you know, show show them, show them that from down there I blitz. If I'm from down there, I might not. Uh, might drop back. So, you know, I think we're just building towards, you know, the unknown on, you know, if they see whoever down there, what is he going to do? You know, and sometimes that speeds up the quarterback clock in his head and when he has to get the ball out of his hand. And, you know, that definitely opens up a lot of things we can do as far as look-wise as well. So, um, you know, it was definitely fun get, getting in there, you know, getting around the ball a little bit. Knowing firsthand the adjustment it takes as a rookie to, to this league, um, not really. Um, I felt like, you know, he was one of the best quarterbacks in the draft. Just from me playing, you know, at the at the collegiate level, and you know, having a chance to see some of those guys, and you know, really watch their tape, and you know, he went to the national championship two years in a row, had a tremendous game against Alabama's defense, which is arguably one of the best defenses in the year, each in, each year and, and year out. So um, I think it was a little bit more, I think they were trying to over, what's the, what, what's the word these guys use? Yeah, they were trying to overanalyze him. Um, you know, he's a play, he, he's a winner. You know, his team went to the playoffs all he was there. Um, you know, he lost one, one, one. Um, and the one he lost was a great game too, and he had a great game. So, um, you know, I, I'm, I'm, I'm not shocked at all. You know, I kind of expected this from him. You know, we talked a little bit when we was at the Heisman. Um, um, so um, he's doing exactly what I, what I thought he was going to do.